Hey guys, welcome to Tabi Eats. Today I'll be attempting to make these adorable treats from the popping cooking series. And the first time I attempted to do this, I failed miserably, which is why you don't see a video in our library. Uh, the only one I have of is of the sushi one that I did. If you want to check out the popping cooking sushi, go ahead and click right here. You can also go and check that out later on because I have a link at the bottom in the description box. Since this is my second try and I have you guys with me, I'm pretty sure I'll succeed this time. So, let's get started. Um, we're going to be making um, three of these things here on the box. And uh, let's look at the back. The directions are in Japanese. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we're going to open up the box. Oops. Now be very careful because we are going to be using the box later on. Okay. And that's why you want to open the box very carefully. Um, just tear along the dotted lines and take out the little package. Look at that. Even the package is really cute. Okay, let's put the box to the side. And let's open the package. Now we're also going to be using the package as well. So um, make sure you cut on the dotted line right here. So here are the contents of the set. Um, there are two packages of um, powder, um, the sprinkles, we even have a uh, piping bag, um, some ice cream cones here, a tart, a tart crust, two pieces of wafer, a little spoon, and we have this container that we also need as well. First thing we have to do is we have to cut this part off. Um, this is uh, to measure the water. So let's do that right now. As you can see, you have two pieces now. Here we go. I'm going to cut one into three equal squares. Like so. Oh, okay. That's not too bad. It's still crumbly. Oh, okay. Hmm. I wish, I wish uh, there were like dotted lines on these as well so that they would be easier to cut and I'm going to clean that up okay and I'm going to cut these up as well um, this one I think a little smaller so I'll cut it right here please cut nicely please okay there we go I'm glad I'm doing it on a cutting board because I'm getting crumb crumbs all over all right so you sort of want a nice piece like that, a rectangular piece for that's for the ice cream. Okay, so now it's time to make the cream. Uh, let's see. So I'm gonna put this into uh, one of these. Open it up. Oh, it smells good. It smells like um, like strawberry shortcake. All right, I'm gonna put the powder inside. I'm gonna put the uh, vanilla cream into the other slot. Hmm. I can tell you guys that this sure smells good. Hmm. It smells really good. It smells like ice cream. Alright, so you got your powder in and let me go get some water. Okay, it says to add two triangles of water to each one. Let's do that to the strawberry first and get your little shovel and mix it up. There we go. You know, I have to say that, you know, the first time I did this, I, I did not enjoy it <laughs> because I expected it to be child's play since it is a toy. There we go. Pouring water. Mix this up as well. Alright, okay, I think that's good enough. Now the next thing we are supposed to do is put the cream into this small, tiny piping bag. So, let's do this as well. Okay, let's put it on this side. There we go. Whoops. I can't waste any. I got some on the cutting board. Just gonna scoop that up and put it in the bag. That's the last of the the vanilla okay and let's put uh, the strawberry on the other side Oops. okay 
Okay. More of the strawberry on this side. Have a little bit more. So far, so good. So far, I'm not messing up. Shove the cream down towards the end. Come on, go down. Okay, there we are. Now it's going down. And then it says that we are to clip the tip off on the dotted line. So I'll do that. There we go. Okay, then let's uh, shove it further down. Okay, oh, there we are. Okay, okay so we'll make the ice cream first, shall we? And, um, I'm just gonna pop my two ice cream cones in the stands like so, so they are ready. Let's hope this works. Hmm. Okay. Well, it looks a bit watery. <laughs> Damn it. Let's see. It's a bit watery, isn't it? Alright. Hmm, I wonder if I put too much water. It says two cups of water. What do you guys think? Huh? Too watery? Damn it. Okay, well, we have watery ice cream cone. Okay, I'm gonna put this to the side for now. Okay, now it's time to make the cake. For the cake, I'm gonna be using the three wafers, like that. One, whoops, two, three, four. Okay. Alright, I'm gonna put this piece of wafer on top, like so. Put another one on top. Cover it like that. And then what? What do you do next? What do I do next? Ah, okay. Yeah, I really think that my cream is a bit watery. It is watery. Nah, okay. That just looks sad, doesn't it? Sad piece of cake I would even serve to guests. Alright, but can't be helped. Put that to the side. Alright, and then finally, the tart. Right, here's my little tart boat. Okay, it says to fill the bottom with some wafers that I have left over. So I guess that's to create volume. So that's like my my cake. All right, put it in there. I really need to um, practice more. So why is it so hard for me? I don't understand. Okay, here we go. And it says to crisscross. Like that. Hmm. Definitely too soft because <laughs> ah, it's oh, it's still cute, I think. I guess my ice cream is dying though. Oh, okay, all right, it's okay. You know what? I'm just gonna set it up. I'm just gonna set up my my little cake shop here. Okay, um, here we go. It says this is my plate for my tart. So I'm gonna place that up there, like so, and. This is my plate for my cake. Maybe I'll add just a little more sprinkles to my cake. Okay. Oh, that's my cake and my ice cream cone. It's kind of dying like that. And this one is like, ha, <laughs> it's melting. All right? Sprinkle it. Sprinkles, sprinkles, sprinkles. Sprinkles always make things better, doesn't it? Right? Just 
use up all those sprinkles so it looks festive and cute. No! Seriously? Ah! Ah, my cake! Ah! Okay. This one... It's a sem semi-fail. Oh well. Okay guys, this is my um, popping cooking um, semi-successful results. My ice cream came out too soft, so it looks like pudding. The, the, spr the heart sprinkles actually save it. The tart looks okay. As you can see, my cake is just a blob of mess. Um, hmm. Okay. But um, yeah, that's done. And um, let's see what it tastes like. Mm. <laughs> so sad. Okay, so um, obviously it was not 100% successful, at least not in my eyes. I mean, my frosting turned out to um, thin. I, I probably added too much water. My ice cream turned out sort of like melted ice cream. <laughs> okay, so before it melts any further, I'll take a bite of the ice cream. Itadakimasu. Mmm. Mmm. Actually, it's pretty good. Real ice cream is better, but um, it's not bad. As you can see, it also melted. Alright guys, um, I think I think we all know what the rest is going to taste like, so I'm not going to eat those. So sorry guys, sorry to disappoint you, but it didn't turn out perfect. I wish it did, um, but uh, maybe we'll do that again next time. Um, I want to try the other ones, like the hamburger and the pizza ones. Uh, let me know what you guys thought of this video in the comments down below. Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And um, uh, definitely subscribe to your channel if you haven't already done so. So, uh, yeah, until next time, um, take care and see you guys again maybe tomorrow. Okay, bye!